So here we have the book Seven Simeons by Boris Artsy Bashev. This is one of the two Caldecott Honor Books from 1938, which was the very first year of the Caldecott Award. And Seven Simeons is an old Russian folktale. It's the story of a king, King Duda. And here is King Duda. King Duda is a very clever, rich, handsome king who is a bit greedy. And his greatest wish is to find a bride who is as good looking as himself. And here you can see him looking in a mirror and admiring himself. And so he asks uh, travelers who are visiting from all over the place if they know of a potential bride who is as good looking as he is. And he hears of a princess living on an island very far away with a very protective father. And of course he is determined to find this princess and win her love and enter the seven simians and here are the seven simians they are seven brothers of the family simian who live simple happy lives and they each have a somewhat magical talent and it is with the help of these seven brothers and their talents that king duda is able to steal the princess away from her protective father and her isolated home and in the middle of the story here they demonstrate their talents that they have and then they set out to go get the princess and here is one of the brothers meeting the princess and her father for the first time and the princess on the way return trip to King Duda turns herself into a bird at part of the story and then, of course, King Duda and the princess meet, and thankfully King Duda does say to her that she may return home and not marry him if that is her wish, but of course she decides to stay and everyone lives happily ever after. I love the illustrations in this book. They are so light and airy, especially when you compare them to the medal winner of 1938, which is Animals of the Bible, and the other honor book, Four and Twenty Blackbirds, um, Artsy Bouchef only uses four colors in his illustrations, red, gold, green, and black. But the way he uses lines versus blocks of color on the pages and what colors, which of the four colors he uses, it's so precise and purposeful. And the composition on the pages really directs your eye to what he wants you to see and across the pages. Um, it's, it's really masterful. And were I to have chosen the medal winner in 1938, just based on the three that I know from 1937, the medal winner and the two honor books, this would have been my choice. And I also like the little line drawings that are all around the text on the pages too.